It's getting dark. This place will be crawling with zombies any minute. I should go. I need weapons and meds. Might be able to find- Is that a gas stop over there? Hopefully it's safe in there. Best to avoid getting hurt. Those are... zombies. Gotta be careful. It'll be a problem if I get injured here. Antibodies. Need to find some. I hope the scavengers haven't cleaned this place out yet. Damn, it's empty. Antibodies. These will be useful later. Thanks, Hermia. Oh, great. Zombies. These things just don't know when to stop. Gunshots will attract more zombies. I should get out of here. Pronto. Slow down. Stay quiet. Maybe the zombies won't hear you. That's a junkyard. Looks dangerous. The road ahead is filled with zombies. I have to try my luck at the junkyard. I can't believe this thing still works. Great, a motorcycle. The out's damn. It won't start. Something's going on with the engine. There are plenty of abandoned cars over there. Maybe I'll find something useful. Oh, more zombies in here than I expected. At least I have a decent gun. A spark plug. Looks like it still works. The repair shop is over there. Maybe I can find some tools. I still need gas. Let's take a look around.
have a bad feeling about this place. Gotta get out of here, ASAP. Yes! This isn't the best place to ride. Let's keep moving. Oh, come on! Now I can lose the zombies and get to the shelter safely. I need a shower. your pass you certainly don't look like an attacker if you want it come with me I'll take you to the inspection over here right here please we appreciate your cooperation welcome to the Raven shelter you need to be inspected and registered before you can go inside Dr. Michael, please come to the entrance. Someone is wounded. A new survivor? Don't be nervous. This is the Raven Shelter. You're safe here. Since this is your first time in the shelter, we need to perform a health and safety check for security purposes. I hope you don't mind. Thank you. Oh, by the way, this is Dr. Michael. He'll be in charge of your checkup and treatment. Hi, I'm Dr. Michael, and I manage all medical operations in the Raven Shelter. Sometimes I also travel to other outposts to provide medical support. Let me take a look at your wounds. Well, nothing serious, just a few scratches. All you need is a bandage and a good night's rest. Follow me. I'll find you a place to rest. This way. Slow down. I'm not as young as I used to be. Look at this place. <laughs> Can you believe that at first there was nothing here but a pile of rubble? I still remember those days. Cain, Sherry, Catherine. The Ravens built all this and gave the shelter a new purpose. There was no farmland or pasture along the river, only wilderness. It was Cain who led everyone to find seeds and livestock. I don't know how many all-nighters Catherine had to pull to get the signal tower and the helicopters up and running. She might not talk much, but she gets stuff done. We even have a school that Sherry built. She's the principal and all the children adore her. You can stay here tonight. I'm sure you'll love it. You'll 
also need this device. Let's see if I can find it. Jeez, I really am getting old. My memory isn't what it used to be. I think I left it in the living room. It's a really cool device. Once you register, you'll be able to check every single thing about your physical condition. In many cases, this device might even be more important than your weapons. It should be on the coffee table in the living room. remember the last time I had a hot bath. I'll definitely sleep well tonight. <sighs> I'm so tired. That bed looks really comfy. That was a good night's sleep. Feeling refreshed. This is amazing. I feel alive again. My numbers should be pretty good now. My stomach's a little upset. Time for a bathroom break. mud. Well, guess my expedition yesterday was pretty eventful. I can't stand this anymore. I have to wash up. These have to be washed. I think the washing machine's downstairs. Clean. This thing still works? I'm not dreaming, am I? Glad you had a good night's sleep. I had to be on guard all night in case you did anything crazy. If you did, I would have busted into your room like bam, bam, bam. I'm not kidding. Outside of this shelter, there's a lot of crazy shit trying to sneak in here. You don't look like one of them. <laughs> Welcome to the Raven's Shelter. I heard you and Sherry are friends. If you're looking for her, just follow the road to the right. She should be at the Memorial Wall. I didn't expect to see you again so soon. You should rest more. You were hurt pretty bad. Just a few scratches, no big deal. What are you all doing here? Is that Kane over there? We're getting ready for the memorial service later today. You can go talk to Kane. He's the leader of the Raven Squad and the shelter. Good to see you again. As the leader of the shelter, I'd like to officially extend my warmest welcome to you. Soon you'll find that Raven Shelter's a good place. 
It's different from any shelters you've stayed at before. We're holding a ceremony for those who died during the Lost City battle. Please take a flower. By the way, something I need to talk with you about. Meet you at the command center after the service. goodbye to even more of our friends. I can't remember how many times we've had to do this in the past four years, but it never gets easier. When I decided to become a medic and study under Dr. Michael, I was hoping to help more people. But there's still so many I couldn't save. There's a lot I can do in the shelter. But once we step outside, we have to guard against our own kind too. Former gangsters, criminals, and mercenaries. We've lost a lot of good people to them. I'm sorry, I shouldn't have brought this up. Life is hard for everyone. I shouldn't let this negativity get to me. No worries, Sherry. We all have those moments. If talking about it helps, then I'm happy to share some of your burden. Thanks for saying that. I feel better already. I applied for access to the shelter's radio station for you yesterday. You just need to talk to our communications specialist, Matilda, to get on the channel. Are you the survivor from the Lost City? You made it! I'm glad I kept calling on the radio yesterday. Before I add you to the channel, let me tell you about the Ravens. What would you like to know? This place used to be one of the temporary rescue camps. Kane, Catherine, and Dr. Michael were all serving here. When the disaster broke out four years ago, they lost communication with the headquarters. But refugees kept coming in. So Kane led the refugees and soldiers to build this place into a shelter. I was one of the refugees. If th At first, things were really tough. We were always short of food, medicine, and weapons. And we had to fend off all those... things out there. But we pulled through. We managed to expand the shelter to the size it is today. We even have a stable power supply and tap water. The shelter, founded by Kane, started off as the Raven Squad. The members were Sherry, Catherine, Roman, Tang, and Yevgeny. But Yevgeny went missing during a mission. He looked scary, but he was actually very kind. Anyway, maybe Kane will tell you more. I don't know why, but I've got a feeling he thinks pretty highly of you. By the way, don't forget to tune in on the radio. The set's right there on the table. Be sure to say hi to everyone when you're connected. been four years. Zombies are getting more restless and they're growing in number. It means a second round of mutation is happening right now. Those crooks and bandits out there have also acquired more firepower and fortified their bases. All these things are pointing to a new crisis. The Ravens need people we can rely on more than ever. The survivors here at the Raven shelter now, actually, 
All the survivors everywhere were hanging by a thread. If we're not cautious, the consequences will be unthinkable. We don't want to become thugs and murderers, but we have no intention of losing our home either. So we and all the survivors have to work together and form a strong alliance. This is the only way to protect ourselves and give everyone a chance to live. But trust is a luxury in the world today. I'm sure you've experienced that. No one wants to trust anyone other than themselves. An alliance? It's almost laughable. So we have to prove it with what we do, whatever the cost might be. We're fighting for the future of the entire human race. I just received a distress call from Redwoods. They're under siege by zombies. If we come to their aid, they'll be willing to strengthen the bond between us and consider forming an alliance. I hope you'll be willing to protect Sherry and assist the Redwoods outpost with her. There's still some time before you have to move out. You can go talk to Catherine. She's our tactical expert. She'll be able to give you some pointers. Beach lower. I'm Catherine, former rescue squad lieutenant, currently in charge of the shelter's defense and tactical operations. I heard about what you did in the junkyard, so I trust that you know your firearms. This is a mic test. Thank you, you everyone. That there are some other things you should know. Catherine's right. Danger's everywhere. I have to be prepared. Outside, only trust your weapon. Welcome, but let me get if you buy. Got enough ammo. Still need food and water. What are you looking to buy? Welcome, well, but that's a perk. You can probably imagine how tough it is to sustain a shelter this size in an environment like this. Like you're ready. Sherry's waiting for you to hang her. Looking forward to your safe return. Remember, hope always survives. Dr. Michael left for the Redwood Outpost at dawn. I heard things are bad there. Let's move out as soon as we can. The Redwood Outpost used to be a wood processing plant near the logging camp. After the disaster broke out, the workers who survived came together and built a fortified outpost using the timber available. The Redwood folks are skilled builders and woodworkers. They make sturdy defensive walls and building materials, which are essential resources to the Raven Shelter, as well as the key to defending against zombies.
You gathered all of this yourself and that quickly? With wood and stone, you'll be able to build doors and walls. It's getting dark, but we're only halfway done. The tree? For our safety, we'd better spend the night in the treehouse. So, can you cook? Nelson said there are some ingredients we can use for dinner. It doesn't sound like much, but I think you're just being modest. Anyway, you're in charge of dinner. Delicious! You're a better cook than Cain and Roman combined. That was great. It reminds me of home cooking. Anyway, since we're not in a safe zone, we'll take turns on guard duty. You sleep first. I'm not just some girl next door. I'm a member of the Raven Squad. Come get me in four hours. Time to take over for Sherry.
wake you up? Did you know? I used to love singing. Now, I believe this heals a little better. I hope that one day I can heal everyone with music again. All right, I better go to sleep. See you tomorrow. <laughs> 